Hello, I'm Glenda Lewis, and here are your headlines from 7 Action News. A home invasion in Superior Township led to a police chase and a fiery crash. Surveillance video shows the stunning moment a teen driver lost control of a stolen SUV, smashing into another vehicle in Ypsilanti. It was at the end of a chase through parts of Washtenaw and Wayne counties yesterday. Three teen suspects were somehow able to jump out of the wreckage and run away. Two are in custody. One ended up in the hospital due to injuries from the crash. Deputies are looking for a third teen. The other driver suffered only minor injuries. An auto parts business in Warren is under federal investigation tonight. The big question is why? Homeland Security confirmed to 7 Action News that it conducted a law enforcement operation at Quality Collision Parts today. The business is located on Nine Mile near Mound. But Homeland Security is not releasing any details on the reasons behind the raid right now. We're told there is no threat to the public and the matter remains an ongoing investigation. And a group called Citizens Detroit launched a new campaign to educate voters about candidates and issues for Democracy 2022. The nonpartisan nonprofit says its mission is to provide unbiased information. There are two minute unedited videos for more than 50 candidates, as well as information on new voting districts. You can see it all at informdetroit.org. Here's meteorologist Hallie Vogel now with a check of your 7 First Alert forecast. As we dry out tonight, could see a few areas of fog, especially those that had the rain earlier today. Temperatures, though, tomorrow in the low 80s, so it's going to be a warmer day. Rain chances return late Thursday into Friday, but a dry and cooler weekend.